Shalom, all praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem, Kadash, double honors to the apostles, double honors to the elders of Great Millstone, Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Bracket Thumb to the whole full X, Shalom, Shalom. Today's video is going to be entitled Yahweh Shai will end the tribe beef. And this is just a video speaking on how the Israelites, the blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans, Although we do have enemies, you know, and although we do, you know, us as the prophets, we let it be known that, you know, our enemies are going to be put down. We also have enemies amongst our own nations. You know what I'm saying? The, this devil, so-called white man, has put divisions between um, tribe against tribe, man. You know, you'll have uh, Mexicans and Puerto Ricans. They don't get along that well. You see, um, a story from my job, which actually uh, inspired this video yesterday, man, because I work in a restaurant and, you know, when you deal with restaurants, most likely you're going to deal with Northern Kingdom, you know, working in the back, cooking, uh, dishwashing, things like that. So, you know, I'm in the office and then the managers are discussing a situation between two Zebulonites. You see, now let it be known that these two people are of the same tribe, man. But according to the world, one of them is from Honduras, another one is from Guatemala, and they they at alts with each other because of where they from. You know what I'm saying? In this in this small little strip of uh, of Central America, that's such a big division to where you know you can't you know work civilly with somebody because he's a Guatemalan or he's Honduran. You see, this is why you need the scriptures. This is why you need the truth, especially you Northern Kingdom, man, because you're going to realize not only <clears throat> are these uh, are these people that you, quote unquote, beef with uh, your same nation, they damn near might be your same tribe, man. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and that's and that's prevalent amongst the Northern Kingdom community, man, is, um, you know, different tribes beef with another one. You know, we all know about. Simeon and Levi, even though the scriptures say they they supposed to be brothers, but nowadays a lot of Dominicans they don't really mess with Haitians like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Cubans. You know what I'm saying? Um, the the discrimination against Cubans they they showed you that in uh um in Scarface man. You know when Tony Montana came over as as an immigrant, hey, a lot of people wasn't fucking with him, man. You know, like I said, Mexicans and, and Puerto Ricans, all of that, man. You know, we don't have to get into it. But the title of the video is that Yahweh Shah is going to end that, man. Because first and foremost, this truth is getting pushed out more and more in different languages, especially Spanish, man. You know, I know the brother from Denver do uh, Spanish videos. We got a Spanish camp in Chicago, Spanish camp in L.A. You see, so... You know, we got hey, we got brothers down there in uh Mexico, we got brothers down there in, in South America. So the way your Howard side is gonna end this tribe be first is by waking up the elect of the uh respective tribes, man. There's gonna be members of the elect that wake up and you know what? I'm not a Mexican, I'm not a Guatemalan, I'm not a Honduran, you know, I'm not a Puerto Rican, you know, I'm an Ephraimite, I'm a Simeonite, I'm an Issacharite, I'm a Zebulonite, I'm an Asherite. You see what I'm saying? These are the uh these are the things that is going to move forward to end the uh the beef between tribes, man. You know, even amongst the southern kingdom, man, you have you have uh Benjamites who don't fuck with Judites. You know what I'm saying? This it's this Benjamite guy in my job. Hey, I, I'm cool with I'm a Benjamite. But I can't I can't tell him that, you know, I'm I'm of the same same tribe because he thinks i'm just a judite you know he think i'm just i'm just a light-skinned nigga no man I'm, <laughs> I'm from the tribe of benjamin he can't understand that like i said uh judites beefing with benjamites levites beefing with benjamites levites be beefing with judites you know what i'm saying even uh even the uh nigerians man because we understand that nigerians are uh they are uh, you know the are, are myth it's like it Israelites are mixed in with Nigerians and other nations on the west coast of Africa. 
but let let them come over here to America. They they gonna treat you like a nigger, man. You know what I'm saying? I did a video when <laughs> when I was down in Texas last time speaking on you bougie ass Nigerians, man. Y- y'all need to wake up and realize that y'all Israelites, that uh that the niggas that y'all look down upon when you come to this side of the world, y'all of the same stock. But that's that's the fucked up mindset because they think it. Oh, we we better than them. We more hardworking than them. You know, so only the Nigerians click up with the Nigerians, man. It ain't supposed to be like that. You know, all Israelites is going to link. All Israelites is going to vibe in the kingdom, man. It's not going to be none of that colorism, none of that uh, tribism. All that shit going to get stamped out, man. But this is 1 John chapter 3, verse 15. Whosoever hateth his neighbor is a murderer. And ye know that no murderer hath eternal life abiding in him. Right, so there's going to be... Uh, Jake's dead die just because they don't they don't like Iskarites. You know, there's gonna be Jake that they, they catch nuclear flame just because they don't want to be around uh, Puerto Ricans or they don't want to be around uh, Haitians. You know, they don't want to be around Colombians. You know, when when we come into the truth, if 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 you had that uh that uh that hatred upon you, that gets washed away. You know, especially in like uh, cities like L.A., you know, that's that's more uh, that's more segregated, man. You know what I'm saying? You you could be in different. You could be a black man in a Mexican hood, Mexican Mexican man in a quote unquote black hood. But, hey, they're not going to treat you the same. But when you come to the truth, like I said, that gets washed away. You show love to all brothers, man. And that that's the uh, the tone that we set here at Great Millstone. No, because you have you have members of other camps that are trying to do away with the 12 tribe sign, trying to say that these people ain't ain't that people. You know? It's uh it's men that's <laughs> that's no longer on fire trying to do away with the whole 12 tribes chart, man. That didn't go far. <laughs> but this is uh first John 2 verse 11. Uh first John 2 verse 10. He that loveth his brother abided in the light. And there is none occasion of stumbling in him. But he that hated his brother is in darkness and walketh in darkness and knoweth not whether he goeth because that darkness has blinded his eyes. Right. And, you know, in in the time of Jacob trouble, there's strength in numbers. In the time of Jacob trouble, it's good to know who your real people are, man. And there's people that are, that are, are not people, but Jake specifically that are going to die with the with the racist colorist separatist or separatist mindset and get caught up man you know you never know that uh you know you might be an iskarite northern kingdom brother you never know that that southern kingdom man might help you out and get you know survive longer you know what i'm saying or you you a southern kingdom member you never know you might click up with some with some northern kingdom members you might not speak a speak a leak of, <laughs> you might not speak a lick of spanish but the lord might put it on the spirit to help help you out man you know that hey that's like I said that's why we show love to all tribes man we don't we don't do that tribalism we don't do that black only thing man but our people are so wicked they hey the tribe the the tribe is uh beefing with themselves man you know going to that story I made or I, I said from my job man had the Honduran beefing with the Guatemalan not knowing <laughs> according to the 12 tribes chart y'all in the same tribe man Goofy ass dudes, man. Jake, Jake is just goofy, man. They they just look for opportunities of contention, you know, opportunities to to be a demon, man. But this is going into the law, Leviticus 19, verse 15. Ye shall do no unrighteousness in judgment. Thou shalt not respect the person of the poor, nor honor the person of the mighty. But in righteousness shall thy judge thy neighbor. Right. So you're supposed to judge your neighbor according to his deeds. According to how honorable, how integral and integrable that man is. You know? How how he worships and serves Yahweh by Shimyal Shah. That's how you judge people according to righteousness. But now, in 2022, you're being judged off your skin color. You're being judged off what language you speak. You're being judged off what location of the earth you were born in, man. Let's read that again. Ye shall do no unrighteousness in judgment. Thou shalt not respect the person of the poor, nor honor the person of the mighty, 
but in righteousness shalt thou judge thy neighbor. Thou shalt not go up and down as a talebearer among thy people, neither shalt thou stand against the blood of thy neighbor. I am the Lord. Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thy heart. Thou shalt not in any wise rebuke thy neighbor and not suffer sin upon him. Right? So there's, there's Jake's that that'll see some wickedness going down and intentionally not say anything just to let that man get fucked up. You know, you're not supposed to do that. You, you're supposed to uh, be your brother's keeper, man. Because what's the, uh, you know, one of the most important commandments is to love your neighbor as yourself, man. You know, love your neighbor as yourself. And that's not a culture that's instilled in Jake community right now. The culture is, uh, you know, hey, look out for yourself and fuck your neighbor, man. That's that's really the uh, the culture of Jake. But it's Leviticus 19, verse 17. Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thy heart. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor and not suffer sin upon him. Thou shalt not avenge nor bear any grudge against the children of thy people. But thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. I am the Lord, man. With that, Lord willingness is edifying. All praises, honor, and glory. It goes to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rukah, Kodash. Double honors to the apostles. Double honors to the elders of the great millstone. Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Brakatham, Tzorofalek, Shalom.